Hi, welcome to Dr. Mix. Here's part three of how to build your own artist website. I'm using Wix, the kind sponsors of this video, and you can sign up on wix.com forward slash go forward slash Dr. Mix and follow my steps as I build my new professional artist's website. I am uh, about to check how this looks on a mobile device. Remember, most of the traffic nowadays is mobile, so you really need your website to be mobile compatible, which my old website is not, which is why it's not performing so well. So let's go back to the editor here. So I'm on my homepage right here. I've got, I mean, the content I will need to put in, but in the meantime, I wanna make sure that my website looks absolutely stunning on any platform. So let's switch to mobile. That's cool. You know what, I can skip this, because I think it's simple enough that I can figure that out. Okay, so I've got the text. It's clearly too big. This is in the wrong place. The picture, of course, is not cut for mobile. So let's see if I can change the background. Right, if I go image and then upload media, upload from computer, I am going to go to this mobile friendly version that I've done. Right, change background. And here you go, that's pretty cool. Oh, let's see, here you would have your mobile menu. Okay, I get it. So I think I can just simply make this smaller. Let's see how I make it smaller. Double click on it. All right, and like this. All right, Claudio Passavanti. Do you know what I can do for, for the mobile version? I am going to align it to the right side, make it even smaller, and then have it up here. How's that? And then AKA Sunlight Square, AKA Dr. Mix. I'm gonna double click on it. Do you know what? I, let me align it to the right as well. Claudio Passavanti, AKA Sunlight Square, AKA Dr. Mix. Upcoming shows. I like the way it looks right here. So this, this seems to be fine. Let's see the other pages. Bio. Oh, so it's the same thing that it's doing here. So if I go to home, I've learned now I can called background and I can say apply to other pages. Bang, 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 bang. Apply to other pages. Done. And now it should look cool on the biography as well. And it does. Do you know what? I just had, <laughs> uh, just had a moment of fear. Am I changing the desktop as well? No, I'm not. Okay, cool. Well done. Wix, well done. Let's go to the home page again. And that's good. Let's go to the bio page. Now the bio can be up here. Claudio's biography. This is too big again. Let's make it smaller like this. Yes. Close it a little bit here. Claudio's biography is still a little bit too big. Claudio's biography. Yeah. Something like that. And then I've got the Sunlight Square page where my music is, and now it's Claudius Music. Let's do pretty much the same. We make it smaller, we make it aligned to the right, and then it's like that. Okay, that looks pretty cool. And you can play it, that sounds good. Then we go to shows. All right, align to the right, put it here. Gallery, let's make it a bit smaller to the right. Close this one, Claudio's gallery. And here I got my silly pictures. I definitely have to change these pictures. Look at it. I look like a maniac. <laughs> All right. Um, contact. And yes, contact Claudio. This is straightforward. This can be a bit smaller again. We put it up here to the right. I mean, this is fun, you know. I like to do this. You know what? This can go. Yeah. Uh, like this and like that. Done. I think it looks pretty good. Save. Can we preview this? Yes, we can. Home. There's some music here. I guess I can decide what I put there. Looks pretty good. Gallery. Good. Awesome. So let's go back to editor. 
and uh, let's go to the desktop here. You know, I was wondering, how do I customize the social bar? Okay, so Amazon here, yeah. Do I need Amazon? No, I don't. Let's delete it. This is Apple. Should be really iTunes. Have we got iTunes here? Search. iTunes. Yes. I want to match the style of the other ones. So I think it's something like this, maybe. Yeah, that's right. So iTunes, I go sunlight square iTunes. There, right there. And here are all my releases. All right, I think that this, this, this is good enough. Let's use that one. Add link, bang, done. I will fast forward, but I'm gonna do all of them. All right, I think I have sorted that out, and I don't know, maybe I'm just... Am I ready to publish it? Well, let's save here, and let's exit to editor. Let's see if I can actually use it on Claudio.pro. Okay, connect domain, that's what we want to do. Get domain, connect to a domain you already own, select a plan. I could go with this three pounds a month. That's really reasonable, actually. And this allows you to do all this other stuff. That's good. Do you know what? I'm just going to get the good one. Select that. Done. My site is now premium. Let's uh, already have a domain connected. Claudio.pro. Log into your domain provider, go to your DNS. All right, this is the usual stuff. NS4 and NS5. I'm going to go to 123 reg. Change name servers. That's what I need to do. So this and then this. Update. Success. Then verify your domain connection. Verify domain connection. It may take up to 48 hours. Oh, okay, of course, this is, of course, because it needs to propagate. Claudio.pro. It's still on the 123 reg. I'm going to hit pause and hope that it, instead of 48 hours, it'll take just maybe one hour. I'll be right back. And I'm back. So while I was waiting for the domain name to propagate and appear on the internet, I've done some modifications. I think that Claudio, simple like this, without the last name, is better. And then instead, I'm going to have a little um, description there, and you can click to read the biography. This is just a button. And, uh, and also, I found out that you can actually have a feed of your YouTube channel. So I thought, hey, why not put my personal YouTube channel, the one where I show my vlogs, my travels, my behind the scenes, my Sunlight Square music. And it's actually very easy with Wix. So basically what you do, you know what, let me do it from scratch so that, that I can show you. Let me just delete this. Yeah, no worries. So I go add, I go add video, right? And uh, I select this guy, right? I extend it like I like to do quite clearly. And then I pull it down a little bit like this. And then I can click on here and say settings and choose, this is my Sunlight Square YouTube channel. All I need to do is click and done. It appears here and say that, you know, I want to add my Dr. Mix account now. And uh, let me push this down here. So, so how do I do it? I do add that. I can go right from now and say, this is my Dr. Mix channel now, all right? Cool. So, and the way you synchronize channels is quite intuitive, actually, because you, you go to manage videos, channels, and you create a feed, new channel, YouTube feed. And then you can enter your URL name. So, for example, in my case, Claudio Sunlight Square YouTube User Sunlight Square. I think it's this one. You go like this, bang. It sees it, and you connect it. 
And that's how you do it. Done. Okay, let's save. Let's preview. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna have to fix this. I'm sure I'm gonna do so much more because I'm I'm finding uh, interesting features one after the other and I want to use all of them. Let me push this down here. And you know what? Let's see if this finally propagated. And there you go. Here's my new website. All right. Does it load that thing? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Let's see. Biog. Yes. It works correctly. Sunlight Square. I can work a little bit better on this. Let's see the music plays. Yes. Awesome. Shows this needs to be updated. And uh, gallery. Those are my pictures. If I click on them, I can see them. This is great. Contact. Nice. Great. I can't believe this is done. It literally took like three moves. And uh, I wish I had this technology back 10 years ago. In any case, if you want to find out more about Wix, there is a link in the description. I really love this platform. That's where I'm going to host my artist website from now on. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope this was helpful to you. As always, let me know your thoughts in the comment section here below. And uh, stay inspired. Get out there. Make some beautiful music and stay inspired.